Hey YouTube, it's Shuri Like These, and you guys are back on my channel. The company I'm teaming up with today is called Meadow Hair. They sent me about seven packs of their crochet sock locks. I did the individual method. It came out cute. It looks natural for it to be crochet, y'all. Parts is cleansed, y'all see it. But yeah, I only ended up using about four packs. I still have like three and a half left over. And they also sent me this crochet needle with some hair tubes. I'm probably not gonna use the hair tubes though, maybe, I don't know. But I already had an extra crochet needle. But yeah, actually, my earring. But yeah, you guys, I said I was gonna be done using crochet. But I actually like this hair. Like when they said soft locks, they were not lying. Meadow hair. I'm definitely gonna be partnering up with you guys again. Y'all came through. Y'all gave me these soft locks, and I'm in love with them. And um, oh yeah, shipping. I didn't. I don't have Amazon Prime, but shipping was quick. It was about four days. Hair came good condition. But yeah, y'all. I'm gonna be sure to put the Amazon link in the description. So if y'all wanna order this hair, y'all can get into it. Oh yeah, and before y'all watch me struggle to do these locks, make sure that y'all comment on this video, like this video, and make sure y'all hit that subscribe bell because we almost at 600. By the time I upload this video, I'm probably gonna be at 600. But let's get into the video. Okay, you guys, so when I started off with this hairstyle, I had already had my hair plaited to make the process go by quicker because I didn't want to part and plait my hair on camera <laughs> that was my cousin tapping in y'all but anyway back to the video <laughs> so i um the first step i do that works for me is i like to put the crochet needle under the braid and then i like to attach the crochet lock onto the needle then i pull it through then after i pull the lock through i like to put my braid through the hole and I like to tighten it up and make sure that it's tight so the roots can be stable. Then what I do is really self-explanatory. I put the crochet needle through the lock and then I put my braid through with the crochet needle. Um, making sure that the braid isn't showing is kind of a struggle. It takes a lot of patience. You gotta have patience. Patience is key. Y'all know, y'all know. But um, I think I did a pretty decent good job because you know I'm not usually the one doing my hair, honestly. I just get my friend to do it because she does braids, locks, feed ins. Shout out to my friend. Make sure y'all follow her at Beauty by Brie because she will get you right, Georgia residents. But you guys, I forgot how many strands were in the pack, but this is a lot of hair. Like, I only, like I said before, I only use like three and a half, four packs. So the fact that I didn't need all those packs shows that you can do this hairstyle twice with that amount of hair the hair was soft it wasn't stiff at all it actually moved y'all gonna see at the end when i finish with it but yeah i'm gonna just put on this little music and y'all can enjoy the rest of the video <laughs> 